I, I date around sometimes. And I got to say, you, you know, if I'm home alone, I, I like to take that opportunity to maybe spend an evening alone with a lovely young lady that I am dating. OK, how about and if there's no lady there? <laughs> and I'm jerking it. OK, I, there we so, go. That's what we well, need you. I jerk it from the back. I jerk it from the side. <laughs> <laughs> I like to get a mirror, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Hi, can you hear me? Yeah, we got you perfectly. Welcome to the podcast. Thank you so much for having me on. It's an honor and a privilege. Well, it's an honor to have you. Can we get your name, please? Can I give a fake name? You can give whatever you want. Sure. Okay, my name is Emma. Emma, you're on with Gareth Reynolds, Jake Johnson, and our special guest, a dear friend. Chicago native, Lamorne Morris. Welcome to the podcast, Lamorne. Oh, thank you oh, for having me. Oh my gosh. Thank Hi, you. Lamorne. Hey, Emma. Uh, Emma, quick, real quick, what's your real name? Uh, that's a great question. I would love to tell you, but I'm not going to. Good, it's I'm okay. with you, Emma. Nice. Don't be bullied by <laughs> Lamorne. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to be hard, but I'll try. Emma, we brought Lamorne on today because we got your email. We think he's an expert on this subject. So, oh, no. oh, Emma, man. please go ahead and... Uh, would you tell us a little bit about why you're calling in today? Well, I'm calling because I had this super embarrassing story happen to me, and it was so humiliating that I couldn't tell anybody at all. And when I saw you post on Instagram about sharing embarrassing stories, I was like, okay, perfect opportunity to admit a story that I would never have shared otherwise. So that's what I'm calling Great. about. It's a good start. It's a good start. We love this. Yeah. So um, just a few months ago, I had some friends from college who asked me to pet sit for them for a week. And this was like the most, the most exciting thing ever because I live with roommates and there's no alone time and I'm an introvert. And so it's just always busy. And so I jumped at this opportunity to just be alone for a whole week. And so when I get there, I am so excited. I get to just be a human for an entire week. And of course, that consists of just near constant masturbation because there is absolutely <laughs> no place to do that in private uh, in like the way that I would normally want to. Um, so as this week goes on, I am just so excited because I can even do it in the living room, like in public. It's, it's just the most exhilarating thing the whole week long. I am just having the time of my life. Uh, and then the week comes to a close it's about an hour before I'm supposed to leave. Um, I've just finished my final session and I look up and realize that staring directly at me is a pet camera. Oh my God. And I immediately go into the biggest panic attack of my entire oh. life and totally blacked out and threw the pet camera out the window. Because, you know, what else are you going to do in that moment? You know, yeah, it's you can't recorded. throw yourself out the window. It's all recorded, so... so. Yeah, this is. This I'm understanding oh, the fake name a little bit now. I yeah. think I I kind of yeah, understand right? the fake name part. So Lamar, exactly. really quickly, you know now for sure why we brought you on for this one, correct? I don't yeah. know anybody oh, who masturbates yeah. at a level that my man Lamorne Morris does. <laughs> <laughs> I go to work. Oh man, is her the same way? <laughs> yeah, but. <laughs> When I do it, I always make sure I look out for that little red dot in the sky. You know what I mean? Oh, but you, you've been yeah. talking about need... that red dot since the 80s, Lamorne. <laughs> I know. <laughs> it sounded crazy then. Oh, yeah, yeah. How can you I, tell, uh, though, if it's, like, wireless? There's no red dot. Tell? There's no red dot. Listen, if you didn't see a red dot, I got news for you. They may not have been recording. Yeah, I bet I'm they were. I'm praying. So, yeah. okay, first of all, I'm a... So, the, so the question is basically, in, uh, and I'm asking, not telling... You spent a week house sitting some pets. You masturbated all week. You're afraid that they saw, correct? Correct. And I have not spoken to them since. I am too humiliated and I have no idea how to approach this. Are they close wow. friends of yours? They uh, are, but they are out of state. So I don't actually have to see them that often. How, how long ago was this? Just a few months ago. Okay. Just. That's a... I got news for you. Huh. They saw it. They, I mean, I think for sure. That's oh, man. And, and I also think everybody in your extended group of friends has heard about it. I like that you just see this as a real masturbation holiday. That's very relatable. Anyone who I've <laughs> ever pet sat for or stayed in their house. Absolutely. Like when I had roommates, it was like when I lived with my girlfriend at the time and she would leave town. It was just I really understand the let's let it rip uh, attitude. 
and I fully support it. So I don't want you to think that we're like, you know, what you did is, I, look, I've been there. I think that's great. I support it. <laughs> uh, unfortunately, yeah, technology has caught up with us house-sitting masturbators. And um, All right, look, this and- is shameful and embarrassing, but I also... If I'm alone in a hotel room, the first thing you got to let it rip. The way they call the body lotion, like bo- it's like body lotion hotel. Really? This Wait, is hold, masturbation hold on, Gareth, sauce. Gareth, can I interrupt for a second? Because Lamorne sure. is making faces as if he doesn't yeah, let it rip. He's shaming us. Yeah. Well, that's a lie. Know, Come on. Yeah. No, no, no. It's not. It's not that I listen as a single man. You know, <laughs> these hands are don't get much use <laughs> because I can tell you <laughs> others do. You get what I'm trying to say? I, I, nobody gets what you're saying. We're talking I'm about masturbating. What, yeah. I, what I'm saying, yeah, what I'm trying to say is I, I get, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, no, I'm, we're, what I'm trying we, to say. Gareth and I have, have all admitted <laughs> that, you know, we let it rip and you said something about these hands get used. Are you talking but, about yeah. on yourself? No, no, they don't get used. I'm still they're unused. I have, you know, I'm I, I date around sometimes, and I gotta say, you, you know, if I'm home alone, I I like to take that opportunity to maybe spend an evening alone with a lovely young lady that I am dating. Okay, how about and- if there's no lady there? <laughs> and I'm jerking it. Okay, I- there we so go. That's what we need you. I jerk it from the back. I jerk it from the side. <laughs> <laughs> I like to get a mirror, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I like to put that mirror on the floor. I like okay. to get creative. Okay. Slow down. Right. Just slow You've down. overcorrected. You've overcorrected. I like to take all the security cameras in the house and put them in a circle. You know what I'm saying? Just so I can really make sure. The idea, the idea of you setting up with mirrors is incredible. <laughs> It's like the end to enter the dragon, but with masturbating. <laughs> oh, You're laughing. I'm out here taking notes, though. So thank uh, okay. you for that. So Emma, he, so here's where we're at. So you let that you let that week go. It's a tough situation. <laughs> it is very embarrassing. When you said the way that I want, what does that actually mean? Like when you said, what do you, you mean? You said you had oh, the living yeah. room to yourself. Uh, I want to know how embarrassing this gets before we start figuring out <laughs> if there's a move. I mean, are you just like quietly oh masturbating under a blanket on a couch or how are you Lamorne Morris in it? Do you have mirrors set up? Are you getting weird? Where are we at here? That's right. Oh, man, we're talking like exhibitionist, full volume, problematic uh, types of videos, just okay. wow. everything that you could possibly you imagine. Types of videos. Can you give us a feeler Kinky of what's stuff. problematic? Yeah. What's your search history looking like? Oh, just, you know, power dynamic kind of things. Emma, I'm with you on power dynamic. Uh, so <laughs> I knew you would be safe. The question comes when you when you finished this week, right? And you so you I'm gonna just try to put myself in, in your situation here. You're house sitting, you're fired up. What a great week. You masturbate like crazy. You have yourself what you know, like a little staycation, if you will. Then you see the camera, and you know, if this is serious, which is what we're taking it as, that's a fucking living nightmare. If I if yes, I had friends who saw me masturbate for a week. I would be so oh. deeply embarrassed, oh, and just, I would have. It's, it's, you guys, I mean, it's, play it's this is real. Play this is real. Oh my that god! And it really deep, is the worst. That's a deep shame. I am telling you, I have never been closer to jumping out of a window. I, I really like the panic. Just yeah. like you yeah. have to just not <laughs> yeah. be here anymore. Yeah. So this is the worst thing that could have happened. So when it ended, uh, and that you they come back and get the keys, there's no turnover. You didn't have to see them. Nope. Nope. Okay. I, I left it under a trash can and that was it. I just never spoke to them Understood. again and haven't heard anything either. So do you have a mutual friend who you uh, trust like a buddy? Cause I think what we need to get to here in terms of your extended group and just a life of living with a certain level of embarrassment and shame. Uh, oh, I think God. we got to know if they saw it because there is a reality of they have a pet cam, but they don't watch it. Right. Like I had right. a, but. A buddy of mine had, uh, is a house sitter and he was house sitting for another friend. And you could see in the video what that person's doing. And my friend said, like, you know, you know, because a light would go on in movement. OK, so we got to just figure out like some people have these like a ring camera and they're not even set up anymore. So do you have a trusted third friend, uh, Lamorne Morris, if you will, that you could go to <laughs> to kind of you know, bridge the situation? Do you have anybody near them that you trust? Possibly, but would I have to tell them the story? What you could do in this situation is you could ask them 
if they ever said anything about the house sitting, you could say like you really enjoyed it, blah, or, blah, blah. Go ahead, Lamar. Or you could say you lost something. You could say, is there any way you could check the cameras? I less, I, I can't seem to find my <laughs> Lamar, credit card. I know Lamar. it. You can't hmm? do that because if they didn't watch the videos. No, uh, no, 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 no. I got no, no, no. Jake, 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 huh. Jake. I got news for you. Huh. These cameras, they record sometimes 60 days. That's it. Ooh. Yeah, sometimes less. Days. Sometimes less. Sometimes less. They can't have forever but it would storage. Be, it Ooh. would be interesting if you were like, I left my rings and they were like, did you check your vagina? Because we checked the tape. <laughs> and uh, it feels like that's where most of your fingers were. It would also be a nightmare if you if you said, hey, will you uh, check the tapes? And they go, oh, we haven't watched them. And then they sit and watch and go, "Yeah, she asked us to watch her uh, masturbate yeah. for seven So we days. don't know where your wallet is, but we know where it isn't. <laughs> yeah, that feels like its own exhibitionist Agreed. kind of a that thing. I don't problems. know if I can do that. Gareth, what you got? Um, yeah. Well, I think that first of all, do you know what kind of camera it was? Have you done any research into kind of the yes. tech? Like, okay, oh, so yeah. what kind of camera was it, and what do you know as far as the time that it holds on to a recording, and how you know if it's recording? Yeah, okay, it's good. been months ago, so let me tell you, I did block out a lot of this for trauma reasons. But sure. I do remember I Googled the type of camera that it was, and I was excited that it was not plugged in. But then I found out it was a wireless okay. camera and had a What's second the, panic. Attack. Emma, do you remember the name of the brand? Oh, it was, I think it was called Pet Cam, but it was something very similar to that name, like a I, play I on words. Okay, okay. I got you. Hey, hey, listen to me. It You're looks good. like a little uh, Apple charger. Like You're a little good. Uh, block. So, Lamorne, you're kind of going was with... Was it plugged in? Uh, it, you're kind of going with, but plugged in doesn't necessarily matter. Yeah. No, it's, unless it had a battery. You know, if if, it's, if it wasn't plugged into a wall, there's right, no that, power source. Yeah, that's true. Well, it means at some point it probably stopped recording if it was. But I'm just curious. Yeah, I could very I mean, easily be on battery when they left. I'm gonna kind of go towards the advice mode here for this call. And Emma, as we've said before, the advice is not not necessarily good, but we're trying to be on your side. We're trying to help figure it out and. <laughs> Thank you. you know, the truth is getting caught potentially masturbating for a week straight is a humiliating life experience, but Terrible they stuff. have not brought it up. So yeah. I, I personally, if I were you, I wouldn't do the third party thing I was saying. I would bury this in the deep graveyard of secrets and move forward. I would never bring it up. I would just keep this as one of those life shameful moments and hopefully one day in years, you're drinking with them or you're at an event and you can hint at it. And hopefully either you get the truth or just bury this one and move on. You know, that was, that was going to be my plan until your podcast. Lamore and Gareth, you guys got any thoughts on what you would do if you were Emma? You know, I would look them square in the eye and I would use keywords to see if they <laughs> flinch. Uh, give you an know example. What I'm saying? Pretend them. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, you're at a wedding. So, so hold on. Yeah, okay. you, I, you house sat for me. You're Lamorne. I'm Jake. You masturbated yeah. for a week straight. You saw there's a camera. We yep. see each other in four months at a wedding right. of a friend. What's up, yeah, Lamorne? In the back of my mind, knowing that I shot all over your sheets. Okay, cool. So, um, <laughs> Jay, Jay Johnson, what's going on, man? Not much, my man. How about you, bud? Man, me and my girl, we got we got into it yesterday. You know, it's crazy. It was a very uh, interesting power dynamic that we had. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's cool, man. Cool, uh, cool. Did you did you get any of that shrimp cocktail? That was good. I had like two cups of it. Oh man, you know one thing that I do love is shrimp cocktail when it's <laughs> when I'm eating it. Are you okay? I'm good, man. I'm good. <laughs> Say, Jake, real quick question. But while I got you here, um, because it's rare that we see each other, has there ever do you ever get chance to be alone? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? When the old ball. I'm going to take off, Lamorne. Right? You're acting really weird, and I don't appreciate this vibe at a wedding of a close friend of ours. My man, that's awesome. Also, I you watched you jerk one. off in my house, man, and I don't find that appropriate. No! <laughs> <laughs> no! That was a great demonstration. I so appreciate the role play. Thank you, guys. Yeah, Garvey, you welcome. got anything yeah. here? <laughs> Well, first of all, what a great power <laughs> dynamic. I'm a little turned up, so I get it. Um, you and me both. Here's what I'll say. I think Jake's I think Jake's advice is right. I think Lamorne, you know, if you want if you want to know, then something like that is the way to go. But I think Jake's right. In order to know, you got to inform them more and I just think that's probably right. And I'm just going to tell you my gut, my gut is that they didn't see it. 
I don't think they saw it. The only thing that bothers me is that you haven't spoken to them in so long. So it might be worth floating out a text for some reason Hmm. just to not even find out, just to kind of like be clear, we're moving forward. Maybe you saw me (laughs) diddling for a week. This is good, yeah. Maybe you didn't. But either way, I have now realized that we are moving past. We live in a different world. We live in a post-me doing this world. And, And let's just move forward. Hey, so, Gareth, could that text be about like the pets? I don't. I Ooh, think if it was like idea. a week ago, I think if it was a week ago, yes. But I think that it's been months. I feel like it should be something else. Otherwise, I feel like you're kind of still living in it a little bit. Lamorne, go That's ahead. You, you're, you're pointing a finger, Lamorne. Go ahead. Yeah, but I also I also want I want you to be really, really careful here because we are walking a very, very dangerous line. OK, we don't want to we don't want to kink shame anybody. Because no. everybody does it. Everybody does it. It's almost like you went to take a shit and realized you left the door open and there was a camera pointing. You know, it's just natural. What you're doing is Yeah, a great thing. analogy. Yeah. Uh, it's also, natural. Why, when you're talking like this, why has your voice changed? Because honestly, I'm a like scientist it. and professor of love, logic, <laughs> like and also labias. So I'm no, here. But, but here's what's <laughs> different. No, this is, we all masturbate. We don't all masturbate in other people's homes while their pets are I watching do. us. I have. You just admitted to it, Jake. No, yeah. I'm, I'm talking hotels. I've house sat and whacked it in there with the cat sitting next to me. What are you going to do? Yeah, gross. <laughs> I'm just, so I'm I've got a question, guys. Emma. In terms of the email reach out, uh, did you bond with any of their pets? Yeah, oh, absolutely. Uh, what what kind of pets do they have? I know it's going to be ironic, but a cat. Okay, so you it. you connected with the cat a little bit? Uh, oh, very much so, yeah. I would personally go a little bit different than Gareth and something, and I would write something like, you know, hey guys, just thinking it, what's the cat's name? I, I'm hoping you're changing the cat's name too. I don't. I don't. We don't want oh, to. Shoot! Be able I did to trace not. It I did not. Gertrude. Right. It's Gertrude. That's Gertrude. the real name. Yeah, that's right. Okay. So, yeah. could you possibly write something of? And is this weird to say something like, "Hey, uh, hope you guys are good. Had a funny memory of what a great cat." And if they do not write back, that means you are an enormous character in their discussion of the girl who masturbated in front of nonstop and you're a huge character if they write back like oh a w w <laughs> you're the best then they didn't watch it is my guess okay guys so I, I, I hear, what do you guys or... what do people think well here's you? why this I is would... a tough okay, this is a hard one let, let's say let's say you hit their car in the driveway and you're wondering <laughs> for a while do they know i hit their car i don't think being like um, how's the car driving? I think get away <laughs> from this area of thinking as much as possible because let's say they did. Let's say they did. Then you're going like, hey, let's circle back on when I, you know, played with myself all week in your house. I think you go with something more like, I don't know. I don't know the specifics of the relationship, but something. If you can yeah. think of some other reason Connecting to reach tissue. out. It's yeah. just saying, hey, we no longer, we, we, we don't do this anymore. And the way you can find out maybe is if they ever ask you to do it again. If That's they right. ever ask mm. you to do it again, you're in the clear. Or, or they're perverts. Yeah, or they're <laughs> perverts. They're they like that power <laughs> dynamic. Because they might say, hey, do you want, uh, we, we're going to take our cat with us this time. We're going to set up some more pet, uh, pet cams. Do you mind house sitting for just the night? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and, can we watch you house sit tonight? So, Emma, I got a question for you. Yeah. Uh, What do you kind of want to do here? Because, you know, what we've kind of found is people who call in have their instinct and how they want to handle it. What's your gut telling you to do? My gut was telling me to do the same thing that you suggested, Jake. I was just going to bury this and pretend like it never happened, like really push it back in my memory. Um, I I did tell one of my friends and I said, listen, I'm going to tell you a story and then we're never going to talk about it again. Okay. So that was sort of how I prefaced the story to anybody. So honestly, I was going to do that. That's sort of what I'm feeling is right. But okay. I do like the idea to send a text, uh, maybe unrelated. Now, I've got a question. Is this out of character for you and your friend group? <laughs> um, yeah, <laughs> like, I think I, so. Like, I'll be yeah. honest, if Lamorne stayed at my house, 
and he masturbated every day, truthfully, all bits aside, that would be out of character and it would warrant a talk. Now, if he masturbated in the shower or, you know, outside of public, but if I came, if, but if I looked at a video, I was like watching my dogs in the living room and he's watching porn with his pants, I would go, hey, Lamorne, what's up, my man? Like, but there are other friends Maybe Gareth is one of them that Thank I would be you. less surprised by. <laughs> Thank you. I live in rarefied error. If, like, the, if the Garf man was standing on my dining room table with no bottoms on, I would go like, yeah. hey, man, That's just right. don't break anything, my friend. So <laughs> Stop Emma, wobbling your, so much. <laughs> <laughs> Stop dancing while you do it. Just finish. Why, yeah. yeah. Oh, why do you lose your balance when you end? <laughs> and why do you, why do you giggle so much? <laughs> What's so funny about that? <laughs> it's been going on for a long time. <laughs> In your group of friends, if the story circulated that this happened, would everybody kind of laugh or would it be shocking? Shocking. I Shock am okay. the professional yeah. put together one out of the Amazing. group. Oh, wow. I'm the one that has the answers. I'm the one that is probably looked at as like a mom figure. So this is very out of character. What do you do them. for a living? I would love to tell you that because you are going to love that, but I'm not going to tell you on air. Can okay. you give us okay. a, without any specifics, tell us, or you're School afraid teacher. Of, of people It's definitely it. in the same vein of this conversation. I think you got two paths forward. I think it's an either bury it, but I got to say, as we're talking and getting to know you a little bit, I don't think burying it's the move. I think that you got to sniff around and see if there's a uh, bomb in these woods a little bit. I think you got to do the random text and just start a dialogue and see if there's any smoke. The, if the, the way uh, LeBorn and I did that terrible example of the wedding, I think there's something to that. Okay. What do you guys think? Yeah. Either way, opening it up, kind of clearing the air in whatever way, or even if you don't have to, clearing the air. And just starting to see the vibe. I bet I bet you'll be able to tell a little bit of what's going on. You never know with women. They're good at hiding things. So. That's yeah. true. No, yeah, for yeah, sure. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. I think you come out of the closet with this one. I think you let every <laughs> I think you let everybody know you're a freak. Let everybody know you like to get busy. But Lamorne, okay. how would she do that? If you were her, what would, how would you do this? Like to your group of friends, how do you come out that way? Yeah. Accidentally, accidentally send a video of yourself that you you know when you were in the office alone and say <laughs> late night sesh with myself <laughs> you know what i'm saying and then be like oh my bad you guys does this does this confuse you you know we got to be more open man i gotta say hold on we've done a lot of these so far uh, that's probably the worst advice we've ever heard my man no 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 it's not <laughs> It's not, you know, it's hey, like when, hey, hey, late night not. sesh, you know what I'm yeah. saying? Because what's this one got is, away from me, everybody. What's going to yeah. happen is they're now going to expect this from you, you know, and your secret of like loving to masturbate in front of people's cats in their homes, on their furniture, on, in their in the refrigerator. Mute this man, Kevin, mute this man. Gareth, in closing, you got anything? In closing, look, there's some options. I'm curious exactly what path you'll take. I mean, you basically said it, but I just want to again be clear. I have house sat. I have masturbated on the couch where they hang out. I've done it with the animals adjacent. So as far as you ever going, there should, you should feel you should not feel bad about what you did. I, when I have people come to my house and I can take care of my cat, I know they're definitely doing strange stuff in the places where I hang you out. You know what and I I'm just okay realized? I think I might want to start a business and it's called we house it and we don't masturbate in your house. <laughs> <'Cause apparently laughs> because, it happens I'm going to start one called you have, master sitters. But if you have, if you have pets and you need someone to house it, I don't want people masturbating on my couch. I don't want people well, using it, it as you, a, you're not going to, you're going to have one two person people and they're not going to be good. Yeah. No, I'm doing, I'm doing one that's called pet sturbators. And actually <laughs> we lean in and we promise <laughs> our guarantee is that we are going to be playing with ourselves around your animals, just like you would, just like anybody would. It's gross. Gross. <laughs> so <laughs> I'll see you on Shark Tank, Emma. <laughs> <laughs> I would love I'm to pass see on that idea. Yeah. I got to tell you, Barbara from Shark Tank would go. Now that's a good idea. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I 
am a real estate mogul and I always <laughs> masturbate. <laughs> I masturbate. Mr. Wonderful, every- I'd love for you. <laughs> I'd love for you and Barbara to partner up. That was kind of my dream pairing. <laughs> Mark Cuban, I always masturbate. I masturbate in Dallas seeing him. In the locker rooms. <laughs> we actually have a jack shack in the Mavericks locker room. <laughs> <laughs> So, Emma, I would say my what I want to push you towards, um, but I keep going back and forth. Uh, I, my, my feeling is maybe there's a random email, but I also feel like you're asking for trouble. You masturbated in their house for a week straight. You had a lot of fun. Nothing has come of it. You have not heard. Well, she did. Well, God bless you. <laughs> you have not heard from your that group of friends. There's not chatter. There's no smoke. I think you got to, you know, swallow this grenade and just kind of move forward. All right. I think that's pretty, pretty solid advice because if they do know, I'd establish the connection. Yeah. 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 Lamore and Gareth, you got anything else in closing? No, I think that's right. I I think, I think, I think reach out. Let's clear the air. Um, But I'm curious what's going on with Lamore. Lamore, (laughs) in closing, you got any final advice? Don't be ashamed who you are. You know, you're a freak. You know, I, I I'm not ashamed. I'm not ashamed. I got a lot of straight to camera roll videos out there. You know what is what that? Saying? What does that mean? Do you want to plug any of those? I'm, I'm yeah. a poor. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, look out for my hidden folder in my iPhone. Shout out to. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to my hidden folder. <laughs> Shout out to the dog pics folder on my phone. Yeah, I don't have right. a dog. Here's to the hidden folder. Yeah. Uh, so Emma, we all got in, one. At, at the end here, we always like to ask, uh, uh, what do you think that you're gonna actually do? I think that I am going to bury this in my trauma memories and pretend it never happened and send a text to reach out just to see if they're going to pretend everything's okay too. That makes a lot of sense. All right. Well, I want to say thank you uh, for calling in. I also want to say thank you to the always charming, the always handsome, the freak in the sheets and the freak on the streets, Mr. Lamorne Morris. Damn. God damn. Hold on. Give me a second. Thank (laughs) you. Make sure these cameras are on. Bye, everybody. Thanks, Emma. Bye. Thanks, Emma. Bye, y'all.